hi guys in this video we'll be looking at wikicat price prediction and also alongside btc price prediction in this video we'll be seeing some of the reasons why you shouldn't panic and sell your wikicat early because the move hasn't even started yet so we'll be looking at this btc chart we'll be looking at dxy chart on the weekly time frame we talked about this dxy chart on the last video we'll be looking at this weekly time frame for btc chart and also we'll be talking about this daily time frame for btc and also this four hourly time frame for btc and also we'll be talking, looking at um um uh, wiki cat um coin price chart as you can see wiki cat is holding relatively well on the um one hourly time frame and also we'll be looking at some of the informations needed um for you to um come to, into a conclusion whether you should sell early or not you understand so let's just head back to btc chart real quick and um, let's start from this weekly time frame for this btc chart as you can see over here we still have several days to go you understand before the btc um having next having that is kick starting may march 2024 you understand and um the the, the 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 last having happened in may 2020 they haven't before that happened in july 2016 and also they haven't before that july 2016 happened in november the first having uh, btc having happened in november 2022 and after they having we usually get a buy signal for this um indicator right here this indicator hasn't printed any um false signal ever since i've been using this indicator and uh, after the btc having we got a buy signal from this indicator and also before the btc having we got series of buy signals from this indicator as you can see this was the first buy signal before the having this was the second buy signal before the having and if you notice after the first buy signal the price of btc has been in a continuous uptrend ever since the first pass buy signal there okay let's go back to uh the 2016 having before the 2016 having we printed some buy signals here and, it, and as you can see after the buy signal the price has been going up continuously the price of btc has been going up continuously ever since until the next having so the next having kicks which is 2016 having and um for the 2020 having which kick started may 2020 we got it we printed a massive buy signal here let me just say a massive buy signal from here ever since then the price has been going up it corrected for a while and um, let's just say each time we print a buy signal on this indicator the price usual it is it, it's usually a sign that we are likely to see a continuous price movement to the upside except yeah price cannot go up um forever so we are likely to witness a little bit of correction and uh, my name is isaac in case you're new to my channel don't forget to subscribe to the channel like this video drop your take in the comment section below and also we have a course um for uh new beginners in the web3 crypto space and also for intermediate um people in the web3 and crypto space and um the link the the, the number to order for the course will be in the description of this video and also the number will be displaying in your on your screen you understand so hit me up and then request for the course and um, the course is designed to equip you with the proper knowledge needed in order to make massive profit from the crypto space and also the web3 space you understand you also have to be positioned before the next btc having and also before the next btc bull run because usually after the having let's just look at um this 2020 having after the having we usually get steady price movement steady price movement to the upside and then the bull market peak so now after this having that is to kickstart 2024 we are likely to experience steady price movement to the upside until the next uh, 20 uh, um, 2025 20 century bull market um cycle you understand so let's just check um um wiki cut out real quick so the reason why you shouldn't play with your wiki card holding one the number of holders on wikicat is just sitting at 36,000 members so just imagine if the number of this address the number of these holders get to a million damn 
that's going to be massive like seriously and by the special grace of god um you you're likely to be among um us when we get to a million holder two million holder and the rest you understand so uh okay sorry about that okay what did i just do oh my god i think i just um separated the what's it called okay let me just go with this one okay let me just ah god let me just go with this one since i've uh, mistakenly clicked something so as long as the price is above this support significant support level which we discussed in the previous video i think we are still good to go this significant support level should be watched you can just check it out follow my mouse of um, course um the support level is around 0. 0. 0. 0.70 and then 1287 as long as we're not breaking that support we are good to go and the moment we're breaking this trend line right here this blue trend line you're seeing to the upside um that has um um been va valid for about three touches you understand the moment we're breaking below this trend line is going to be disastrous for wiki cat and uh, we got rejected from this resistance area we talked about in our previous video the video i dropped close to 26 or to there about okay yesterday or day before yesterday so we got rejected from this resistance area like i said in that video the moment wiki cat is able to close few hourly candles above this resistance area oh my god it's going to be a moonshot for wiki cat we are likely to um get back to around 15 million to 16 18 million dollar uh market cap for wiki cat you understand so let me take this out and um let's just check wiki cat out on coin market cap real quick so if you're looking at wiki cat on coin market cap the price of wiki cat is sitting at um 0 0.08 um seven zeros one eight five so let's imagine let's assume you are investing fifty dollars i'm not saying you should invest fifty dollars whatever i say is strictly my opinion but you investing fifty dollars now considering the market cap which is sitting at 11.7 million dollars by the time um we we we, we 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 dropped um three zeros from the current price of wiki cards oh my god your 50 dollar investment should be around over 140 130 to 140 thousand dollars you understand just imagine that should give you around 266 uh, sorry 2066x if i'm not mistaken you understand that should bring the um, the pump price to around 266 thousand um, percent pump for wiki card which is very very possible because a lot of altcoins are also going to perform massively um more than that in the next bull market cycle and after the btc having yeah so we should expect a market cap of um wiki card by the time the price um gets to 0. 0.000 zero five we should expect the market cap to be over 20 billion okay over 10 billion to 20 billion thereabout you understand so well that's it and um if you're looking at the fear and greed index um the fear and greed index is currently sitting at on the green um grid area so a lot of people um are greedy now because due to the market and um, let's head back to the chart before i forget so if you're looking at the daily time frame the golden cross is about to happen for btc which is a bullish sign the moment that golden cross is getting confirmed oh my god the price of btc is likely to go higher you understand and um, as long as btc is not losing this area at around twenty three thousand two hundred dollars and also twenty two thousand seven hundred dollars i think we're good to go we are likely to experience resistance on this curve at the top of this curve so keep an eye on that curve and um, if you're looking at btc on the weekly i told you guys as long as we are not breaking below this twenty one thousand five hundred dollars btc is still good to go there's no cause for alarm so we are still above there and um dxy dxy is bullish that's why the overall uh, market if you're looking at the weekly that's why the overall uh, the weekly can do for our btc is currently bearish because dxy is bullish when dxy is bullish btc will be bearish vice versa you understand so my name is isaac and i'm um, the amount you can afford to lose in case you want to grab um gain access to the web tree course just dm me on whatsapp the link to my whatsapp number will be in the description of this video and i'm um, as always my name is isaac and um, peace out